Hey guys, Nicholas the Reactor here. I'm sorry I didn't make my video last week because the reason why I didn't make my video is because I was on a vacation for a while. But you know what? It's been a while since I have made my video because guys, I want to talk about something real quick. So, I'm going to lie dude. A couple days ago, which is last Friday, right? Tell me that make freaking sense, dude, okay? A couple days ago, which is last Friday, I found out on Pickaboy's YouTube channel, known as Kept Me On The Camera, that Charlie Chill, who happens to be Pickaboy's brother, decided to give drugs to one of his nephews. You know, Pickaboy's nephew named Jacob. Are you freaking kidding me with this stuff, dude? I mean, come on now. You mean to tell me you're going to give drugs to his... To pick a boy's nephew because you mean to tell me that he did some crazy freaking stuff which I don't understand why and you mean to tell me you're gonna give drugs to Jacob he explained to us how he manipulated us and all of a sudden he he been explained he showed the footage of how he did that and that's because Michael's father you know pick a boy's father known as angry grandpa he kicked Charlie out of the house for what he did. And that's the main reason why he decided to head to the pole house by moving in near Michael's home. Excuse me. Are you freaking kidding me right now? And you mean to tell me that you decided to do some crazy stuff inside of the pole house, which I don't understand what was he thinking. So I found out that freaking Pickle Boy... Been, I found out that Pickle Boy was talking about. That's good. I found out what Pickle Boy was talking about, right? He also been doing some. He been doing some crazy stuff in the pool house. Like he been, he been doing some crazy stuff. Everything that Pickle Boy was talking about, and I found out that he destroyed the goddamn pool house because he had to call the cops on Charlie. You know Charlie Chell. And all of a sudden, he been, you, this is why I freaking don't like him now. Because he is the most hated YouTuber in the world, guys. So, they did call the cops on him because he was getting to a threat to his own brother. You know, Pick a Boy. He's getting the threat to Pick a Boy. You want to know why? Charlie Chill is nothing but a freaking drug addict. A freaking, um, child molester. And a freaking alcoholic. And a freaking snake he is. And then, about two hours later, come to find out from Pickle Boy, he says everything that is true, because I'm speaking the truth from this, guys. I'm speaking the truth from what Pickle Boy was talking about. He also assaulted his freaking girlfriend, you know, Pickle Boy's girlfriend, Bridget. He assaulted his girlfriend for some reason. I freaking cannot stand Charlie Chill now. Everybody hates him because of what he did last Friday, guys. Because this guy is the most hated YouTuber in the freaking world, guys. You want to know why we don't like him? Because of what he did, which is crazy as heck. And then Bridget did film because he'd been dealing... Well, they've been dealing with Charlie, you know, Pickle Boy and Bridget. He's talking about everything he said in front of his mouth, which is crazy as heck for Charlie Chell. You know what? They haven't seen... And I'm going to lie, dude. Pickle Boy said to us that he been, they haven't seen each other for four years now. Four years. Because he, for example, been doing some crazy stuff at first. Four years they haven't seen each other, but now they not, he's not going to see him ever again. Because of what he did was crazy. He should be in jail for the rest of his life. After what he did, which is crazy as heck. Yes, thank you. Of what he did, which is crazy as heck, dude. And he made some videos, which I... Dude, you're the most hated YouTuber in the world, man. I'm telling you this right now. The dislikes, that's because nobody likes your videos. They, Everybody hates you for what you did. And nobody likes you, dude. Everybody hates you for what you did, dude. And on another part of the video, I remember... Like, also, a couple days ago, I believe it was on the first day of July, the next day when that happens, a few, a few couple videos later. 
when Pickle Boy been explaining that he's done with him after all that stuff he caused, I saw the bruises on Bridget's face after what he did, after what Charlie Chill did to his, what he did to, um, Pickle Boy's girlfriend. He assaulted her. Cause you know darn well he did that stuff, which is crazy as heck, dude. And all that stuff, which is a goddamn lie. Remember Steve Wilco show? That's why I'm going to say this to this dude. If he takes a line at the test, that's what happens if he's on Steve Wilco's show. He will say in the results of his line at the test that Charlie did not tell the truth. You want to know why? Because he's a goddamn liar. He will tell Charlie Chill. Yeah, thank you. He will tell Charlie to get off his stage for being a liar. That's what's going to happen. Because... All he said was a goddamn lie. Pega Boy has nothing to do with that. He will never hurt Bridget. He will never destroy the pool house. It was on you, Charlie Chell. You want to know why it was on you? Because you're a freaking liar. You know darn well you should not get drunk to a young boy. So Pega Boy did come. He was at Angry Grandpa's house. You know, his father's house, right? His One of his nephews named Jacob, he did come by to talk to his uncle about what what he did was wrong. He explained to him how he gave him weed and stuff, which is crazy. You know what my answer is, Charlie? You know, Charlie Chell, you a goddamn liar, dude, because of what you did to uh, Jacob. You know, Pega Boy's nephew. Everything was a goddamn lie. See, this is this is the problem for Pickle Boy's brother, you know. You know, Pickle Boy's brother. His brother just crossed the line. You know, Charlie Chell, he crossed the line. He's a goddamn liar. He hurt, he gave drunks to one of his nephews, you know, Pickle Boy's nephews. He also hurt one of them. And he's a threat to hurt his own father, you know, Angry Grandpa. See, this is why Angry Grandpa's done with Charlie Chell forever. We everybody, we all hated him now. We don't like him now. We all hated him. He's the most hated YouTuber in the world. And I heard what Angry Grandpa said during the video the other day. Like, I believe it was last week, right? He told him that he is not allowed in Angry Grandpa's property after what he done. You know he's the most hated YouTuber in the world now. Nobody likes him after what he did it to his, what he did to the pool house. Giving trunks to his to Pickle Boy's nephew and attacking his attacking Pickle Boy's girlfriend, which is crazy as heck. I can't believe he did that. All that stuff was a freaking lie that he said. Man, he's a freaking liar. He's a snake. He's a drug addict. He's also alcoholic and a drug abuser. Or I'm sorry, child molester. Yeah, that's better. He's a freaking child molester after what he did. Charlie Chell, do yourself a favor. Do yourself a favor and and go do yourself a favor and be in jail for the rest of your life or be in prison because everybody hates you for what you did. Even our uh, pink boy's sister Jennifer, she was upset about this. She was crying after what he did to her. And I heard what Angry Grandpa said, how does it feel the most hated person in the family? I, he is the most hated person in the world. The most hated YouTuber in the world. And I'm glad that we unsubscribe to Charlie Chill's YouTube channel. Because he is disgusting. He is a alcoholic. You think he is alcoholic. He's also a freaking drug addict and a freaking snake he is. Charlie Chill, you, sir, <coughs> need help, dude. Pinker Boy will see you in court because he doesn't want to see you anymore for, for what you've done. Why? Because you are the most hated YouTuber in the world, dude. I'm telling you this right the heck now. Everybody hates you for what you've done. I don't care if you make some more videos because your videos will get a lot of dislikes on each and every one of your freaking videos, Charlie Chell. Because you you know what? You're the most hated YouTuber in the world. 
We don't like him. That's because everybody hates him. We all don't like him because he's the most hated YouTuber in the world for what he did. I will never forgive him for this. Because this guy just crossed the darn line. He's, he, he's been lying. He's a liar for what he said in his mouth during the phone and stuff. Dude, it was your fault that you hurt his girlfriend. You know, Big Boy's girlfriend. It was also your fault for everything you have done, dude. <clears throat> With that being said, I just don't like him now. We all hated him. Everybody hates him for what he did last week. For right, for right now, Charlie Chow, we don't like you. We will never respect you because you, sir, do some, you did some crazy stuff, which is terrible, which is horrible. You, sir, needs to go to jail for this. You need to go to jail. And you are, you, sir, is the most hated YouTuber in the world, Charlie Chow. You are the most hated YouTuber in the world, Charlie Chow. That's got to be it. Be sure to be sure to check me out on Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat down in the description. I mean, I'm on Pega Boy Bridget and Angry Grandpa's side on this one because Charlie Chill just crossed the line and went too far for what he did. If you don't believe me, there is a video called The Truth About Charlie Chill, and it all it, it's on his video. I've seen this video ever since after what he did. I will never forget for what Charlie Chill did to Big Boy's girlfriend for abusely attacked her like that. And all that crazy stuff he did was terrible. That's what I gotta say. So I hope you guys have a great Thursday and a nice evening, and I'll see you guys then. Bye guys. And again, we will he is the most hated YouTuber in the world. Again, I'll see you guys later. Bye guys. And Charlie Chill. You're the most hated YouTuber in the world.